Hey dad, do you and your partner clash over how to handle things with the kids? Over the next three minutes, I'm going to walk you through my approach to getting past these frustrating disagreements over parenting styles. And it's going to be a bit different than what your parents used to do. If you're looking for a way to stay calm and avoid letting these disagreements turn into much bigger conflicts, I have a free de-stress checklist that I can help with. Drop a line below and I'll send it to you. First, I'm Art D. I'm your favorite dad strategist, and I'm your go-to if you're a dad who is feeling stuck in stress and self-doubt. I'm going to help you find peace and clarity so that you can be the committed, present father that you always wanted to be. Relationships and parenting are already tough enough, and I know how easily small disagreements about parenting can turn into a huge conflict. I want to share what's made a difference for me. It can get even harder when you and your partner can not agree on how to handle things. Maybe one of you wants to be a little stricter, while the other thinks it's better to let things slide. You can feel like you're always clashing over what's best for your kids. Most of us try to push our own narrative and approach and explain why our way is right. Just hoping that the other person finally jumps on board for some strange reason. Or we might just give it in to avoid another fight. But listen, deep down, you're still frustrated and the issue doesn't go away. Am I right? The problem is these arguments are often less about parenting styles and more about the internal dialogue you're having with yourself. When you're not aware of how these inner thoughts affect your relationships and your reactions, you'll keep having the same argument again and again and again. So please, instead of trying to convince your partner, let's try this. I invite you to focus on recognizing your own internal dialogue. Understanding why certain situations trigger certain responses will help you change your approach. It often makes it easier for your partner to come to agreement too. An approach, this approach works because it helps you get to the root of why these arguments keep happening. When you see the internal thoughts driving your reactions, you can respond in a way that builds understanding instead of creating conflict. So listen, if this sounds like something that you'd like to explore, drop a line below and I'm going to send you my de-stress checklist. It's a free tool to help you recognize stress signals before you lead to bigger conflicts. The de-stress checklist will guide you in recognizing when you're about to react and get to a boiling point so that you'll be able to take steps to stay calm and be in control. Listen, this way you can approach these conversations with a clear head and avoid letting disagreements spiral out of control.